I'm also dying uh, yeah. 9 11. Oh, yeah, of and course. Next day, my brother went to the, uh, yeah. Afghanistan for the war. My yeah. brother in the US Army. Yeah. So it's nothing to do with Islam. I don't know why people are making this and, uh, political. I'm originally from Pakistan. Pakistan right. is the biggest partner in war against war terror. Again. Yeah. Um, okay. Would you like to, uh, can I write on your name? So, yeah. Rather not. What is your, Sheikh, what, do you, what is your okay. name? Sheikh Ali. So, do you, this is, uh, are you coming here uh, frequently? I usually do Friday pray here because uh, Friday is a big, uh, big gathering here. Yeah. And you, normally I go to the church street, yeah. the regular pray because there are more people over there and here. Because yeah. there were more gathering in the regular day compared to the Friday, the, like a special pray. Yeah. So it's a like, big place to, you know, to be. Uh, how do you feel about uh, the statement President Obama made last Friday? To uh, he's a he's a president. He has to support. Yeah, uh, all my all group, uh, all, all religion. It's yeah. not only just for Jewish or. Uh, I think Obama is just basically uh, try to explain what is America is about. Yeah. Sure. So as a president, he should define more America than any anything else. Right. Right. So he's basically defining because the America then, is. Uh, if you look you are equally equally American. Doesn't matter you're Jewish, Christian, Muslim, or doesn't follow any religion. Yeah. So he's basically defining. He's not just promoting one particular religion sure. or one particular place of worship. How do you feel being in this country that is known to have tolerance toward religion, freedom of religions? How do you feel? The people around the country are opposing this center here. I don't understand your question. How do I feel about uh, tolerance in the uh -huh. US? It's, it's not only Muslim living in this country. There are many religions, many cu cultures, and many di big diversity here for people. They are Buddhists, non-believers, they, they don't believe on God, there are so many people live here. So they cannot just uh, target one uh, one religion and say, okay, because there are few people did this 9-11 thing and then they expect all, they brush with the same paint brush with the all Muslim in the same term brush with Atta or those guys did it. And the, and the thing I want to say, like, uh, if you compare the rest of the country to the Manhattan, sure. the people live in Manhattan. Yeah. Majority of them, they are not opposed to this mosque. Of course, yeah. And they should have better understanding what happened here because they probably uh, were the eyewitness yeah. on the day of 9/11. Yeah. So I think the rest of the people, uh, uh, compared to Manhattan, rest of the country, maybe they have misconception of Muslim. Yeah. And misconception of Islam. Yeah. If, you look, if they will know that true teaching of Islam or uh, true living style of Muslim living in New York, uh, in, in the United States, probably they would have changed their opinion. Uh, or they will think different. Yeah. Like biggest, biggest thing you can compare the people living uh, outside the Manhattan compared to living in Manhattan. Yeah. And most of the people living around this neighborhood, yeah. they are not opposing uh, this project. Sure. How long have you two been in the United States? More than 20 years. More than 20 years. And yeah, more than 20 years. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, and what is it? And you live in, in the New York City area? I live in Queens. And, uh -huh. uh, and I live in Riverdale, Bronx. Okay. And how old are you, if I may ask? 39. Okay. I'm 42. Okay. Thank you so much you for your time. Are.